suspicious. And I, y'all can say what you want. You can get mad at me for saying, but I'm just keeping it funky. And on to this Joe Jackson abuse thing. I think Joe Jackson is getting a bad rap. He's being a fall guy. You mean to tell me? Because Joe, what Joe Jackson did, he spiraled down the path that he did. No, oh, man. Let me put it this way. I'm in my thirties. Cats in Michael's air, to my air, down to probably if you're 28, 30-ish, up to probably and up. Motherfuckers were getting yoked by their old man, whether you liked it or not. You were getting yoked. Now, if you couldn't take that shit, that's on you. Like I said, if I if I if I made a mistake, say if I did something that deserved a belt whipping, I got a belt whipping. Now, how many of y'all remember this? I got the switch. They pulled this, did that, and switched me. Look, man, I'm not saying, look, there's a difference between getting abused and getting beat. I think dude got beat. I don't think he got abused. And let's face it, he wasn't doing all that goofy shit around in Joe's house. Let's keep it funky. All that stuff was not popping off in Joe's house. Whatever you say about the man, he kept a tight ship. I can't fight. I can't fake on the man. I think Joe Jackson getting a bum rap and everybody used him as a fall guy. Because let's keep it real. How come none of the other family members are coming out like he did? Yeah, they're going to say he beat me. Just sometimes you deserve to get beat. When Joe said don't do that and you continue to do it, you're gonna get beat. Now he just came home one day from work and like they were like, how you doing daddy? And he went, that's abuse. Do I think he did that? No. I just think he was, I just think he beat his kids. And no offense with some of these badass kids, they need to be beat. No offense, fuck a timeout. Y'all talking all this timeout? Look, man, oh, you know what a timeout would do for me? I would just play the role and be nice for the whatever timeout that I acted to being what I did again. That's keeping it funky. And let's face it, he, Joe had like 30, 30 million kids, so he had to keep some discipline on him. Like I said, I don't think Joe abused him. And if Joe really abused him like they said he did, when you would think that his wife would have divorced him a long time ago, I'm just keeping it real. The Bible says spare the, spare the rod, you spoil the child. And Joe Jackson didn't believe in sparing no child, children with no rods. So if it's in the Bible, go at it, Joe. Like I said, I, I support Joe. I think he's getting a bum rap. Like I said, if that was the case, how come like, all the other kids they weren't crying to the hills? Did not sit on see on everywhere he Joe laughed on Michael's nose, whatever. That's not funny, but let me ask you this. How many of you guys is old man? It's hard on you like that. And he grow, he trying to toughen you up to be a man. That's all he's doing, man. It's, he just toughened people up to be a man. That's all he did. I don't think he came home and was like just beating the fuck out of kids just to beat the fuck out of them. I just think he was disciplining his kids. He may have went a little overboard sometimes, but at the same time, only one of them was doing stupid shit. The rest of them were fucking telling the, to this day, they telling the line, so. That's all I have to say about this. I'm just saying, look, man, I listen to Michael's music. It's just the later stuff. I just feel sorry for his family that they're going through right now. I really do. Because Michael did do a lot of good for the world. He donated this, he donated that, he did stuff for charities, he did that, he did this. I mean, he tried to help kids, but at the same time, I think the interviews killed him. I think when he paid that money, that definitely put the perception in people's heads, whether one way or the other. No matter what you say, one way or the other, it put the perception. I think he had too many yes men in his camp. But like I said, if that would have been my interview, and he, and the dude would have, the dude would have said, "Well, I don't see a problem." I would have been like, "Cut! It's a wrap. Get the fuck out the house. And leave the camera." So, whether you're pro or con, Michael, like I said, the dude was a great entertainer. He's on he, him, Elvis, and the Beatles are all like this. They all made great music. You can't take that away from the dude. Now that stuff was in the last 10 years. Hey, it is what it is. All I know is a lot of these fucking fans are being really, really, you know, stupid because you didn't hear hiding their hair in none of these people in the last 10 years. All I'm saying is a lot of these fans are being wrong because I know a lot of them made little comments about this, his little stuff that was going on. I ain't gonna lie, I said a few comments. I was just wearing out because what's the dude hanging out with a monkey with a, a damn diaper for? So, well, that's just my little opinions on thought. You can disagree, you can agree. Really, I don't give a shit because we all have opinions and opinions like you assholes. So, 
I'm this is Big Stay. I'm signing off. Like I said, if you don't like what I'm saying, put a little video response or do yada 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 this that and the third. All I'm saying is he was a great entertainer. He was never convicted. Exceptional. Sometimes it's real. I, I don't know. I just say it. I don't know. And that's how I'm leaving. All I'm saying this shit is weird. Just let the God rest in peace. You know, and let whatever maker is a maker, let them decide what he did. That's all I know. But at the end of the day, he came out the same way he went in. So, like I said, he made great music. Never convicted. Never of any allegations. So, like I said, now you got people saying, well, the boy just confessed. Why didn't he confess years ago? If he was going to confess, why did he do it years ago? I'm just saying, I don't know, it's just a weird, weird situation. So, like I said, man, I just think Joe Jackson getting a bum rap. Michael didn't have, he had too many yes men in this camp were looking up for their own pockets. Like I said, I just feel bad for his family before they have to go through. I feel sorry for his kids, because you know, kids, other kids are going to be mean, and this, that, and the third. But like I said, they're going to have to grow up with that, and that specter. So, then again, a couple billion dollars, I'd be like, man, fuck you. I can buy your family. So, man, I'm just saying, thanks for watching. Peace out. Subscribe if you want to. Do a video response. Write your little fucked up comments. And all, yeah. Whoever first quit playing first, man. You ain't a goon. First ain't goons. Alright, peace.